Hello everyone, welcome to the broadcast. I am going to start with a quick little mini read. Today we're going to look for an animal spirit and the letter came up already. Okay. Also we're going to look for another uh, message as well. Excuse me for passing over you guys like this. Okay. You want to shuffle and get another message. Three card draw. Oh, there's one. I started on my cards up, oh, right? Alright. How are you guys? I know I haven't done readings in a while, but I'm here today. I've been called. I told you my energy is the type. Okay, two, two cards. Okay. So there we have those two. Three. As well as to clarify those cards, we have three. Sorry if you guys do not like to hear shuffling, but I wanted to get a new message. Okay. So on there, and fresh energy, I don't know what's going to be the message, but we will see. Okay. 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 So we're going to go with what they want to what they want to tell us all together. What they want to tell us all together. I heard something flip. Okay, it's too many that flips, all right? So they want to tell us a lot of things. So I'm using these new decks. I couldn't find no decks when I was looking. Um, so I wanted to try something, just, you know, out of, something really random. So I found some cards. Okay, so as you will see, these cards have... Um, Eeyore on them. Okay. And then, mm, that's too many. But it did tell us that it was about the Demand Line Mask I'm going to use it as Eeyore as um, the Divine Masculine in this deck. And it says, I've made a mess of everything. Oh, poo. So. Divine Masculine is looking like he's made a mess of some things. And he's still feeling sad, looks like. Okay, one more message. <laughs> and he said it was him. And he keeps coming out. So it is about the Divine Masculine. Okay. I've shuffled this deck now for about three revolutions going on four and it's bringing me back to that okay okay so one more message of what it sounds like what it sounds like the divine master wants to say it sounds like he wants to say something we got to do with tree it could be truth. It could be tr tricks. One on Piglet, please. I thought I heard something drop. Oh, but it's talking about ore. Okay. No, oh, just jump right at me. Okay. Well, they could be crying. It could be about a water sign. Okay, and this person is busy because busy on the top, and oh, burn. Okay, oh wow. Okay, let's get into this. Woo, let's get into this. Let's get into it. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck here, we have on the secrets of tarot, we have a oh, two of cups. Wow, so it's about oops, my bad. Oh, it's about a knight wanting to come to a two of cups. Okay. So at the bottom of the deck is the knight of cups. 
Nine of Cups is about somebody in their feelings and in their emotions about a two-party situation. Somebody that they want union with. Okay, let's see. It's at the bottom of this deck. Okay, and it's about um, the Nine of pen Pentacles. And this person is supposed to be abundant. Okay, so here we have the B. This is the B spirit. The B spirit is about the silence of the lamb. Silence for the lamb. Okay, so what I get from that is lust and temptation. Um, witchcraft is possibly um, in this situation. Lambs. Silent as a lamb. So you got secrets. Okay, let's see what they're saying. <clears throat> Okay, so we have the chariot card. So this person is silent about moving forward. They're silent about moving forward, moving on. They want to make it black and white um, about what is going on between them, the person they are talking to, a person that they want union with, and a person that is abundant. So these two are two people that this person is interested in. Or it could be about this um abundant woman that they want that they're silent and it's lust it's, uh, this lamb is telling me there's lust and secrets about a union that someone wants okay okay so let's get some more information and that's to clarify this chariot it's about judgment so somebody is going to get judgment about a union that is needed about a, or about a nine of pentacles or abundant woman okay and then we also have tree so this person wants some solid foundation when you got a tree of the spirit of the tree so eeyore the divine masculine is wanting to be solid in a two two party relationship with an abundant woman is what it's telling me and what it sounds like it sounds like train it sounds like train so something that is fast moving ahead so they want to come fast towards you they want tree they want stability tricycle so they want to go baby steps you know when you have a bicycle you go with training wheels so a uh, tricycle and it could be a three-party situation as we can clearly see it's complicated truck so this person wants to um um truck to you like bring all of their belongings and as you can really call it see it's all got to do about tro trolley so this probably this pro a trolley is something like in britain they use as like something they pull behind them so like their luggage a trolley or a trolley is one of those shopping carts that they use in the grocery store a trolley a trolley is a train um a trunk so they want to bring their clothes and their suitcase to you or move towards you wow okay so wow okay wow okay so let's keep this spirit out here let's keep this spirit out here because it's going to tell us a whole more a whole lot more things okay so okay let me get another spirit that goes with this lamb spirit lamb spirit that's a lust and witchcraft spirit what is what what and it's a lamb silence of the lamb blood sacrifice okay so somebody might be doing rituals in this situation to keep somebody stuck okay okay here we go okay the next um um spirit we have out here is the ooh the raccoon spirit okay we got the raccoon spirit so this person is probably double eyed i look at it like does this rac raccoons have um uh rings around their eyes so this person could be double eyed when i see they got eyes for you and eyes for other okay and this raccoon spirit is um very sneaky so raccoons you know prowl in the night and they you know are destructive not night animals you know um okay so in this person this um raccoon is going around the world they're going around the world um with their sword a young woman or or a man because you know um that it doesn't um it's interchangeable um spying or deception 
reflecting back over their shoulders okay so this person is like i told you this person was a raccoon spirit so this person is very sneaky five of swords energy you know um you know um but they want to come in and clean up what they've made a mess with so dustpan is what i got okay and what it sounds like it sounds like corn like this person be could be corny in a in a tactics this person could be a fork it could be done horn this corny person could be wanting just sex and horse is like a stallion so they want to do like your meg the stallion they want to you know body ride you okay north so they want you to be face head face up face down butt up okay and torn so they're torn between two lovers sexually okay wow okay wow wow guys well wow. we're learning a lot about this male figure male masculine and if this re is resonating with you make sure you follow and um, subscribe to the broadcast and you know book a reading so that you can get your own energy this is a general reading as well okay we're going to get one more um animal spirit to clarify this masculine that we're talking about all right one more uh energy to, to describe the masculine we are talking about okay ch so this this is a ch so ch for cheetah okay so this is the cheetah spirit this is a person that's agile okay and at the bottom of the deck it is a dolphin so this person is not a necessarily a cheetah okay yeah it's a cheetah cheater cheetah okay if you know what i'm saying cheetah <laughs> sounds like okay cheetah so that's why he's up underneath this this um tree not wanting to take the offer that someone is offering because he is already getting his cups filled by three other things okay so the higher fence this higher fence is probably in a marriage um or some kind of you know um you know common law relationship um this person is probably into their body. This person is probably um, um, a f wants to make things official with one of these relationships that this one of these ladies that he wants to be with. Now, this is a lady that he wants union with, and there's a lady that he's in a union with, and it's a lady that he that is abundant that he's interested in this higher funds. Okay, and so Divine Masculine did come out in this deck. I made a mess of things. Oh, poo. So this person knows that they've ruined things with um, at least one of the three possibilities. They know that they've ruined things. And what it sounds like, it sounds like, whoa, well, 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 you know, well, well could be a water sign. Like I said, well could be like, whoa. You know, like, well, water sign, um, what, they don't know what to say, they don't know what to do, they don't know what to, to, you know, where to go with things, will, so now they need somebody to, you know, show them, you know, when you're learning how to drive, you need somebody to show you how to drive the car, how to steer, whistle, so now, Somebody must have blew the whistle on this third party situation. Because at the bottom here, I have B. So this person was busy whistling to other girls, whistling to this third party situation, person, place, or thing. When? Whenever it was happening and why it was happening. So this person was busy. Okay? And at the bottom of that deck, we got... Oh, so uh, brown, down, flower. So brown, this person could be a brown person. So this is up talking about a black person or, uh, you know, a person that is multi, um, multi, multi culture. 
meaning they have multi-race in them. Down, this person could be on a down low. This person could be a down person. They could be pretty cool. They could be um, flower. You could talk about your private area, her flower, her the other person's flower. So somebody's flower is what's keeping him in a what, in a, in a what when, and why situation. And owl. So this person is an owl, like who? So they don't know who to choose, who to be with, who is going to be the best one for material gain for them. Which one is going to codependently um, um, water sign, dolphin, play their game. Because dolphins play in water. But whales, as you can clearly see, they are like a tack. They'll kill killer whales. And, you know, whales, whales are, you know, not to be played with. So this one is a whale. Like, he's, he, he's killing himself over how he messed things up. Tao. So Tao, he might want to throw in the Tao over this situation. Wow, guys. This has been a juicy come back for me i'm so glad to be able to come back and bring you these new cards and these new informations and i want to turn them over so that you can see what they look like on the other side without the words so yeah so this person let's be alive on who we have here divine masculine e or and this is a third floor party because i see three apples here so this thing is talking about a tree and we did get clarification when we clarified it that he was up underneath this tree because he's a cheater up underneath this tree here. Four of cups. We have three apples here. So as basic as it may be, you know, this person is in a third person um, situation. Tricycle. So trying, trying. You see how here, how we have this here. You know, see how this person. And they wants to move forward. Um in this third person but they want justice is going to be served in this situation let's see what's on the bottom of this deck umbrella so they're needing some kind of protection umbrella to me is protection you know you get protected from the elements so yes so some protection with this um judgment is here you know some this is strong decision is needed to be made in these circumstances that we have right here but i want to let you know thank you guys for joining for this um quick read um, thank you for um, subscribing, liking, and commenting. I'm trying to grow this channel up, and, you know, I need you guys' support. So thank you, and come again. Namaste.